As today I'm going to show you how to check whether the given text in the edit text is a phone number. So let's start. By starting, let's open Sketch here and create a project. For in this case, I will create as check. Phone number. Okay, check phone number. So in here in the layout, I will put edit text and a button to check whether it's a number. So I will uh, put as much parent edit text and uh, the margin as five, so we can clearly see it. And the button even margin to five, and the button will be put the text as check number. So uh, when the button is clicked, we have to check whether it's a number. So we have to implement some blocks. So let's put an if condition and then an else condition. And uh, let's put some get a block called uh, length of the edit text equals length of the edit text. So the value we gain from the edit text one. So definitely should be a number if it's 10. So in the numbers, the normal numbers of a phone number should, the numbers containing the length should be 10. So, so the length uh, will be 10. If the length is not 10, it will say as invalid number. So when the value is equals to 10, the length of the value, uh, the number should be valid, valid number. So if it's not equal to 10, so it should be just as invalid number, number. Okay, sorry. Okay, so the edit text one, you should put the text field as uh, input type as numbers. One, put as form, and uh, I am the option as done. Okay, so now let's run. So in the next video I will show how to uh, use IME option. So when you click search of the keyboard uh, to see whether the email, the when you click uh, the particular uh, icon in the uh, keyboard, it show. So in this case, this is the icon go. So when you click that, uh, I want to. Uh, you can implement a toast or any function you want so that will be the next video so please subscribe and uh, hit the bell to get notified so let's check so I put a random number so it's not equal to 10 so it says invalid number again invalid number invalid number it's greater than 10 so let's put numbers to 10 okay so now our 10 numbers so let's put a random number. So this is how I have 10 numbers. So this is a, this is a valid number. So I so hope you understand how to check a phone number. So my next video will be how to implement IME option in the keyboard. So this is the IME of the keyboard. So when you click this, uh, it happened nothing so the next video will be when you click this to make a particular function so hope you understand and please subscribe and thank you